Mine was in a Ford Pinto. 1976 Ford Pinto. Women love the Ford Pinto, man. It had 125,000 miles. It was powder blue. I had me down for my sister. I flew out to Minneapolis. I picked it up there. Go down to Denver, up to Chicago, down to St. Louis, across to Washington, D.C., then up to Boston, where I was going to school at Boston College. And it was the first time that I really understood what the definition of freeway meant. Because I pulled onto the highway, there was this electricity in my spine, like the horizon was just paving in ahead of me, like, wow, what's going on? And body chemistry altered. And it was this amazing thing. And at the time, it was like life was really about how much I could absorb and how quickly I could get there doing it. It was 80 miles per hour. It was all about chasing the next experience, the next person, the next view. I could be on the lip of the Grand Canyon thinking about where I was headed tomorrow. It's not like now that I'm your age. <laughs> Life is like a slow walk in the Appalachian Trail. I'm watching my feet to make sure I don't trip over shit. <laughs> I'm just looking for an open vista where I can just empty out and not think about my movement in time. Just empty out and not think about yesterday, not think about tomorrow, not think about the mortgage or college education fund. Just empty out. And invariably I start thinking about the Pinto. Why is that? Why would that come into my mind? God, I think about the freeway, I think about the girl who was long for the ride. Right? This is what this song is about. Looking back at that, it's called Chasing You. <laughs> Let's shoot out the satellites. We're throwing wishes Yeah, 